Another great day here in sunny southwest Florida. I'm working with Emma and Mike and their dog Cece, who likes to, um, well, nip at people when they come in the house. So I spoke with a tr one of our bark busters up in Connecticut, and he gave me a nice little kind of pre-lesson exercise to work on with the clients. I just showed them what to do. In a little bit, they're going to give me the signal, and we're going to see if we can't basically start the lesson before we start the lesson. So we're going to try to get CC uh, pit mix in a nice, calm, relaxed state, receptive for education without me even setting foot inside the home. And of course, we're going to film it and show it to you. This will be great. All right, I just got the signal saying that uh, we're cool to move in. So we're going to knock on the door and see how we do. Just keep your eye on her? Yes. Now, how does she normally answer the door? Well, she usually... Well, usually she freaks out, to be honest with you. Really? Yeah. So, Emma, come on over here. So don't, no, no grabbing collars. If she moves, we're going to give her to say that word. All right, but try to get between her and the door. Okay. And if she moves, we're going to say that word, and we're going to move into her space, and, and we're going to let her know, hey, not cool. So how does she normally greet people? She runs at them and barks. And barks. So we've been here, what, 30 seconds, but we talked a bit a little bit outside. So fair to say that Bark Busters is working already? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> and we've been here like, you know, like 30 seconds. So, it's, so it's ma imagine how good it'll be like in a couple hours. Yeah. All right. All right. So we went over how to speak dog. Uh, we gave Emma and Mike a couple exercises to work on with Cece. I'm uh, just kind of hanging out of here because we don't want CC responding because I'm in the environment because I don't live with Mike and Emma. So we want CC responding to her mom and dad. So that's why I'm out here. I'm just kind of chilling right now. I gave them some homework. I'm going to be going back in a little bit, knocking on their door, and we're going to see how that front door exercise is going. And um, we'll go from there. All right, hey. We're going to be checking out and see how everything's coming on with Mike and Emma and their pit mix named Cece. Come on back, Emma, but keep your eye on her. So how awesome is this on a scale of 1 to 10? This is pretty much a 10. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> this is pretty much a 10. That's pretty cool. I've never seen that. Okay, now, we're going to invite her in. And you're still in charge of protecting me. So we're going to lower our height and ask her to come. And I'm basically going to do an impression of a tree. Okay, I'm not going to move at all. Okay, ready? So lower your height, ask her to come. CC, come. Mm -hmm. Good, and I'm just going to hang out right here. Now, is she being a good girl? Yes. Yeah, then let her know that. Good girl. Yeah. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Good girl. Great job. Awesome job. Okay. So, so how's she doing? She's doing way better than she normally does. I'll tell you that one. She's actually with me. Yeah. Here, slow your pace down. Gather in the leash. Let's give her a little less leash from your left hand down. Good. So we want that leash loose and relaxed, not tight. If it's tight, we're creating tension. I'm just amazed. <laughs> a little louder, please. I'm amazed. Amazed. Well, we like that. I've never <laughs> seen Cece actually walk next to me. Well, here you go. This is your dog. I'm pretty sure this is your dog. <laughs> Looks like your dog. I'm not sure right now. Yeah. <laughs> not. 